Hey, welcome back. My name is Sushant Satish and I'm your instructor for this MS700 Teams Administrator Associate Certification Exam. In this demo, we're going to go through and learn about how to manage Teams policies for channels. Teams policies control how users can interact with Teams and channels. This includes the availability of features for Teams. For example, whether private Teams are discovered in search result and whether users can create private Teams. If users are not assigned a custom policy by default, if users are not assigned a custom policy, the default global policy controls the available features. A user can only be assigned to one team policy at a time. Please note that the policy changes can take up to 24 hours to take effect. These Teams policies are managed from Microsoft Teams Admin Center and through SharePoint Online and Commandlets using PowerShell. These Teams policy can be controlled by the following settings. The first one is Discover Private Teams. This settings control whether users can see private teams in a gallery view, which enables users to request access to a team. Create private channel settings controls whether users can create private channels or not. Restrict the creation of all wide teams. This settings control whether users are restricted from creating organizations wide teams. This settings is only available through PowerShell. Let's go to the Teams Admin Center where I can show you how to apply this policy or create this policy for the users. So I'm on my Teams Admin Center now. So let's navigate to Teams. And under Teams, select Teams Policies. You can either modify the global or wide default policy or you can add a new one. Give a name for a user, for example, Alex. Create a public channel. After a new Teams policy is created, it must be assigned to a user. Assigning a new Teams policy to a user replaces either the existing default policy or existing custom policy for that user. So let's find out how to assign a user to a policy. You can select a policy and you can click on Manage Users. This is where you would be able to search for a user and add a user. So any sort of settings you applied for this policy is assigned to a particular user. In the next walkthrough, we're gonna learn about how to manage team settings. So I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care.